gradually, meaningly, or ungenerously small or scanty. A niggardly tip to a waiter. Adverb. In a stingy, miserly, or typisted manner. <coughs> so you were exactly right on with that uh, definition of that. And wow. Let's move to this. Uh, this is from Anonymous from the Gmails. This is question to Mr. Fuller, black men with kids. Question, Mr. Fuller, do you think it's a narcissistic behavior for black men that have a bunch of children and not have nothing to do with them at all? And where did they get this trait from? Signed anonymous. Well, for black men, he said to do what? Wait a minute. Oh, let me go back to it. Um, do you think it is narcissistic behavior for a black man or black men that have a bunch of children and not have nothing to do with them at all? And where did they get this treat from? They got it from the white supremacists. Where well, all of our traits come from. The black people on the planet now. We come under the system of white supremacy. We've never known any other government of any kind, ever. Every black person who's on this planet right now in the year 2023 has never known any form of government except the system of white supremacy. I'm making a flat statement now that's either true or false. We have never known any system or government of any kind other than that. And the system of government that we're under now, the system of government called the system of white supremacy in capital letters, teaches black people and trains black people to be girls and boys and now even in the refined stages of the system of white supremacy uh turning us into all types of things sexually that don't have that have to find uh, reach and grab and make up definitions for for us because it's good for the business of white supremacy. And that's just in the area of sex. But it also applies to economics, education, entertainment, control what they do to entertain themselves. Have pay them big money to go on television and do stupid stuff. Don't don't after they look at a three-hour program and turn off, it's almost like a relief when they turn the TV off because they have not learned anything of any value that is constructed. Don't teach a black person anything, but, but make it look like it's a big deal. But when you really look at it, what they actually learn from it, it's not anything that will be of any future constructive value. If we looked at a three-hour program with a whole bunch of flashing lights and glitz and this and that and the other and, and handing out, oh, just give them how many awards we got back there in that warehouse? Well, about four or five million. Well, I want to hand them out one at a time, make them think that it's a big deal. And that's what they'll look forward to. Mm. holding it up, grinning in the air, and think that's the solution to their problems. And we'll tell them that, and they'll believe it. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. All so right. That, 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 in answer to the question, that's, that's what it is. And they tell black males, well, you're men. But I, I got to say this, because that's more to the point of the question that was raised. Black males are not men. I don't care how old they get. Prisoners of war are not men. Never will be as long as they are prisoners of war. 
You're not a man now. That's been taken away. You are indeed a boy. Neely Fuller Jr. is a boy in the system of white supremacy. When they call me boy, I don't get angry because they're telling the truth. If they were telling me anything else, telling me I am a man, that's when I would get upset because I know that I'm not. You can't be a prisoner of war and be a man. It doesn't work like that. POW is not a man as long as he's a POW. You got to get out of that POW status. Then you have the opportunity to be one. But you can't take care of nobody when you're a POW. You're being taken care of. And you can produce offspring, but every black person in the system of white supremacy, you're not taking care of your offspring. These are the white supremacists all free. <clears throat> when a black male right now has a baby, even though he's got, you know, he's supposed to be a husband and all like that, he's no husband. The white supremacists mm. are in charge of him. And he's a child. And any offspring that he has, these are just other children. We're all children. And we're all equal. He's, I am equal to any child that I produce. Because an alien power is taking care of me. I get prison food and housing. Because I'm a prisoner of war. We have to understand that. Okay.